Good morning guys, so this is the first time I've ever done a Facebook Live and I couldn't think of something more important to talk about in my first ever time going live. Um, as all of you on my Facebook will be aware, I am producing a show called They Live In You, Wishing You Were Somehow Here Again, which is taking place on this Sunday the 30th of April at the Churchill Theatre in Bromley with the 7 o'clock start. Now I'm sure many of you will know the reason why I'm doing it, and that's that beautiful woman right behind me, who watches over me every day. Now sadly, eight years ago, I got the worst phone call of my life when I got told that she was missing. Now sadly, four days later, we got the horrible news that she had been washed up in the, the port of Heraklion. The worst phone call and the worst news that anyone could ever have to hear. Now sadly, we lost mum, but since then we have been fighting and campaigning day after day to make sure that we should get the answers and justice that our mum so rightly deserves. We shouldn't have to fight and campaign this much. Now I will do everything in my power and I am doing everything in my power to make sure that I will find her justice. Because the one thing was that me and my mum were very much alike. We were both quite headstrong, both quite fiery, and when we wanted something doing, we done it right. And I will do everything in my power to make sure I do this right. Now, thank you to everybody who has supported me so far and supported the family's fight through Justice for Jean. I know many of are living in other places and not so easy to come to watch the show because it's in London. However, this is a bank holiday Monday, and if you are free, then please, please come and watch what is going to be one phenomenal show. This is bigger than any of the shows I've ever done. It's a cast of over 90, including creatives. It has over 125 people, both on stage and behind the scenes, both equally as talented, passionate, loving and giving as each person. Now the tickets are not expensive, and this show is a musical roller coaster journey that will take you through the real life journey of what it's like to lose someone. But at the end of the day, it has got to be watchable. So I've used creative license to make sure that this is a phenomenal show with a purpose and a reason. There will be moments where myself will be in aesthetics of crime, but there is also happy, rejoicing, productive um, moments that we all need to know about and we all need to cherish in life. Now, there's a live band, there's 43 dancers, and each of these talented people are giving up their time. There's narrations throughout the show which seamlessly tie the show together, making this a one-off charity show not to be missed, making it a full-blown production, not a Churchill Gala, not a concert, but a full-blown production that deserves the audience support and funds that these amount of cast have all given up their times to. So I please, and I hate them to do it, but I beg you, I, I beg you from the bottom of my heart to not miss out on this fantastic show for a fantastic, fantastic cause. As you know, the funds that are raised will go to help our fight for justice because sadly there is no help for British people when their loved one is lost abroad or murdered abroad in our case. But anything that's left over, should we find out or not find out what happened to our late mum, then we'll be helping Dana, which is death abroad, you're not alone, which help a lot of other families who go through the same hell and are going through the same hell as we are from day to day. Now, I plea and I beg, if you are free this Sunday, the 30th of April, then pop down to the Churchill Theatre. It starts at seven o'clock. We've got a cast of over 90 from people from The X Factor, The Voice, Britain's Got Talent, West End Shows, people who are currently in West End Shows, people who are currently going into West End Shows, 43 dancers from one of the best colleges around, and that's Expressions Academy of Performing Arts, a phenomenal creative team, a live band orchestrated by the wonderful Alex Williams, West End Gospel Choir. You really are in for a treat, and I cannot stress, this is not a concert. This is a full-blown musical production with a narrative. You're getting so much for your money. And if that's not enough to pull you in, then there's a over 82 prize raffle and silent auction items. And there is not one bad prize in this. The people of Bromley and surrounding areas and West End theatres have been so supportive of this campaign. 
please get behind and I really hope I see you there on Sunday guys. We could still do some more sales on this and it would be such a shame if that was not a packed house and did not have the audience it deserves. So if not for me, do it for her. Because that's why I do it. And let's remember, hashtag are you aware? Hashtag justice for Jean. Thanks guys.